it's in here. Let's see what it is. What could it be? What's up, Treasure Fam? I'm at the beach right now at a super, super popular spot here in Puerto Rico. A ton of people run and jump off of all of these piers here behind me, and I think a lot of them are losing loot. I got my buddy Paul Cardall right down here with me. Let's get in the water, guys, see what we can find. I'm super excited to see how clear and beautiful this water is, but also, more importantly, what treasure has been waiting for us to find it. This video is sponsored by IBM, whose autonomous self-driving ship called the Mayflower finds almost as much stuff underwater as I do. I'm super excited for you guys to meet the Mayflower later in the video. Oh, got me a dime. I gotta find a ring today, I, or a gold bracelet. I really wanna find a gold bracelet or a gold ring. And I think we're gonna find them. It sounds like a coin, but it could be a gold ring, or it could be a, a gold bracelet. Oh, there it is. Yep, a quarter. That's 25 cents I didn't have before. Got it. What is it? Oh, it's a quarter. Money, money, money. South Dakota, 2006. They must have just dropped this. It's all fresh. Look at this. Man, that's new money right there. Oh, 
That is a big hole for a little sinker. This video is sponsored by IBM and Treasure Fam. Please sit down because this is gonna blow your mind. Have you ever wondered why we know more about the surface of the moon than the bottom of the ocean? The problem is in the past, ocean research has been slow, difficult, expensive, and very dangerous. Thanks to the very smart people at IBM and their partners, we're about to unlock the secrets of the ocean with the Mayflower Autonomous Ship. So the Mayflower Autonomous Ship, what is it? It is a solar powered, super smart, unmanned, self-driving ship that is changing the future of ocean research forever. That's right, I said unmanned. This thing is driving out there by itself and it's smart, it knows what it's doing. The ship has 30 different onboard sensors for collecting all kinds of important data to help with things like climate change, ocean plastic pollution, and marine mammal conservation. IBM played a central role in developing the ship's AI captain. And what that is, is basically the brains of the ship, since there's no human on board, the captain is a, is a computer. And uh, not only does this thing guide itself through the ocean and avoid obstacles and stuff like that, but Literally, this thing learns as it goes. So it, it gets smarter, uh, it gets better at making decisions like how to reroute to avoid bad weather, its status and mission, and just what to do next. This thing is literally thinking for itself and it gets better at its job. 
This is real life, you guys. I'm not gonna list off every single thing that the Mayflower Autonomous Ship measures with its 30 different sensors, because that would take way too long, but a few of my favorites are a fathometer for measuring ocean depth, a digital hydrophone for listening to and recording whale song, and Hypertaste, which is an AI-assisted e-tongue for sampling water quality and composition. So crazy. Ocean research on the Mayflower Autonomous Ship is a lot easier, faster, more cost-effective, and it's a lot safer than just going out there yourself and doing it. I mean, ocean is not a safe place. Treasure fan, there is so much more to know about the Mayflower Autonomous Ship than I was able to cover today, so make sure to click the link down below in the description to see what it's doing to change our oceans forever. Thanks again to IBM for sponsoring this video. Let's get back underwater and see what other treasures we can find. Let's go. Whoa, what's this? Oh! That's like a, a bracelet, it's not twisted up. What happened? I think we got it. A dime!
found so much stuff. That was probably the most jewelry that I've ever found on a single dive in my life. This little thing could be a diamond, so I'm gonna get this checked and make sure that I'm not throwing away a diamond. I'm gonna count these and I'll put the total up on the screen right here. And the old coin award goes to George Washington. This is from 1969. Pull tabs, bottle caps, trash. And I think my best find of the day was this gold chain necklace. This little part right here came loose and uh, the guy lost it forever and I'll probably never find him. Three quick things, Treasure Fam. One, click the link down below to check out the Mayflower Autonomous Ship. You do not want to miss that. Two, like this video, subscribe and ring the bell. And three, meet me right here where I break my record for the most electronics found underwater in one dive. It's gonna be a blast and I'll see you guys right there. I love you, Treasure Fam.